Two Fish Talks. Hi, everybody. Welcome to Two Fish Talks. I'm Miss Brooke, <laughs> and this is my good friend, Ralph. Hi, Ralph. <laughs> We're here to read a story to you today from our favorite book, the Bible. Are you ready? Let's go. A story of two men who prayed. Jesus told a story to some proud people. They thought they were better than other people. Jesus wanted to help them see themselves as God saw them. This is the story Jesus told. Two men went into the temple to pray. One was a religious leader. He was called a Pharisee. People expected God to hear and answer his prayers. The other man was a tax collector. People hated tax collectors because they often cheated their friends. Everyone knew that the tax collector was not an honest person. People did not expect God to answer and hear his prayers. The Pharisee stood alone. He was proud of himself. He thought he was very important. He was even proud as he prayed. Thank you, God, that I am better than other people, he prayed. Thank you that I am much better than that sinful tax collector over there. You know that I don't cheat as he does. I don't sin as he does. I never treat another man's wife wife as if she were mine. Every week I stop eating for a while to show how good I am at pleasing God. And for every ten pennies I earn, I give one of them to your work. Thank you that I'm really quite a good fellow. The Pharisee in Jesus' story was not talking about how special God is, so he was not worshiping God or honoring him. Instead, he was talking about himself and how special he thought he was, so he was honoring himself. Then the tax collector began to pray, said Jesus. He was so sorry for his sins that he looked down as he beat himself on his chest. Oh God, you know and I know what a sinner I am, he prayed. Please be kind to me and forgive me. Jesus looked at the proud people who were listening to him. God was pleased with the humble tax collector, Jesus said, but he was not pleased with the proud Pharisee. Proud people will be put in their place. Humble people will be honored as if they are the most important people of all. God wants us to be humble people because a humble person is who attracts God. We'll see you tomorrow. Bye-bye.